Let me first show you an overview of the workflow. We have an account in Zuora for a company called Acme Inc. They have a couple of subscriptions to our light user product and have fallen behind on their payments. As a result, we need to suspend the account for non-pay. To manage these situations, we've set up a notification on the account when invoices are passed due. The notification executes a workflow to perform the suspension. This is the workflow we're going to execute. You can see that the workflow loads the subscriptions for the account. The workflow then grabs each subscription from the list and applies an amendment to cancel each active subscription. Once we've gone through the entire list, the workflow amends the account and applies the changes. To simulate the account going past due, I'm going to use Postman to send over the cancellation callout. You can see that the request has been successfully executed. Clearly, this would all be happening behind the scenes, and this task would normally be initiated by Zuora. And now you can see the Acme Inc. account has changed to suspended for non-pay and the subscriptions have been canceled. Many who drag, drop, and don't stop.